We're going to start with 10 more and 10 less. That means we are skip counting by 10, but instead of going 10, 20, 30, 40 like we're used to, we're gonna start with a different number and skip count from a different number, okay? Well, just not a number that ends in a zero. So that is called skip counting from any number, 10 more, 10 less. We're gonna first use our place value block so that you guys can see why and how the numbers increase or decrease. So here you guys see how we have 35 blocks. Hello. If I add 10 more, my number here, 35, is going to change to 45. So there's two ways you can do this. You can count the number of tens and then count the number of ones, but really you should be able to see that the three in the 10 spot changes to four since we are adding 10 more. That is the 10 spot. But do you guys see my one spot here? Did that change everyone? No, because we only added one 10. Okay, so now I have 32 place value blocks. If I cross out 10, then obviously we are doing 10 less, right? So if I had 32 blocks and I took 10 away, that means my number will change to 22. And again, our 10 spot has decreased by one since we took one 10 away. And this would be 10 less. Okay, friends, now I have 33 blocks. Hello. So if I add 10 more, anybody know what my new value is? How many do I have now? Yes, Sutik, how many do I have now? 43. Good, we have 43, and that would be 10 more. So the three in the 10 spot changed to four again. My one spot has stayed the same. So now let's go here. Now I have 56 blocks, and this time I am taking 10 away. Who knows how many we have left? And again, you can count the leftover blocks, or you can just take one away from the 10 spot and figure out the new amount. Yes, Rian, what is 10 less than 56? 46. Good, so we have 46, nice. Okay, so yes, that would be 10 less. Let's try a couple more with the place value blocks. Now I have 68. Oh, and I took 10 away, so what would be my new amount? So again, you can count the blocks or you can just take one away from the 10 spot and the one spot stays the same. I will ask, yes, Arish, what is our new number? Uh, 58. 58, very good. So look everyone, six changed to five, one spot stayed the same, perfect. Okay, now I have 41 blocks. Hello. And I am adding 10 more, so now what is my new amount? Let me wait for some of your answers before I choose somebody. Let's ask, Aiden, what is your amount? 51. Okay, did everybody get 51? If you did, you got it right. So that would be 10 more. Okay. Let's do a couple more. If I have 74 and then I take 10 away, what would be my new amount? So again, do whatever works for you. Count the rest of the blocks or looking at the 10 spot, change that number depending on if we are adding 10 or taking away 10. Let me ask Tristan, do you know what the new amount would be? 64. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> so if you got 64, everyone, you got it right. Okay. Friends, if I have 59, Hello. And then I add 10 more. What would be my new amount? Yes, Adyaji, what is the amount? 69. 69. Did everybody get that? If you yes. did, you got it right. Good. Okay. Now let's move on to a different way we can do it without the place 10 value blocks, okay? I have 42. Woo. If I have 10 more, what would be my new number? Now, you don't have place value blocks to count, but remember, just look at the 10 spot. That is the only number that changes. So I will ask Anvika, do you know what the new number would be? So look. 52. Yeah. <laughs> nice, Anvika. Did everybody get 52? Okay, everyone, I have the same number, 
but now I want to do 10 less. So now what would the new number be? Okay, I'm going to call you, Avani. Um, okay, what is 10 less than 42? Um, 32. Good job. 32 is the answer. Okay, if I have 23 <coughs> and I want to find 10 more than 23, what would be the amount? You guys can probably do it in your head at this point, right? Sanaya, what did you get? What is 10 more than 23? 24. That would be one more, so 10 more. So the three would stay the same. The two goes up by one. So what would be that number? 30, 31, 32, 33. Yeah, huh? 33. <laughs> Good. So Sanaya, Sanaya counted on by 10, which is okay too. But our goal is to do this in our head. That's called mental math. So that's what I want our goal to be. Just do it in your head. All right, so 10 less than 23, what would that number be? What would it be? What would it be now? You guys like that song? <laughs> yes, Adya M, what is it? <laughs> it's 13. Okay, did everybody get 13? Perfect. All right, if I have 86 and I want 10 more than 86, what would be the number? What would it be now? Yes, Arish, what would it be? 96. Good job. Okay, then you know what's coming next. What is 10 less than 86? Let me see. Who haven't I heard from yet? Naksh, what would the number be? 76. Exactly. Okay, now I have 95. So let me see. Can you guys figure out 10 more than 95? That'll bring us into our three-digit numbers there, right? Aiden, what is your answer? One hundred and five. Yes. Yeah, so once we get to the nineties and we do ten more, we are going to be pushed up into the three digits. So that's why nine. You can even think of it like this: nine changed to ten. But don't forget, we're just looking at the place value spots. We have actually a real number there. Okay, that means my last number would be ten less. What would that number be? Yes, Ronika. What is the number? Um. 85. Correcto. Okay, everyone.